Hello everyone, I'm JW Speaker and I'm glad you could join me for another uh, review and today I'll be reviewing Mountain House freeze-dried chili mac with beef, uh, spicy sauce with a macaroni, beef and beans. And it's uh, 2.5 servings. Uh, this should be really good. Oh, and it has uh, this saying on the bottom. I always forget to, to show you guys these. It, Need toilet paper or uh, for your adventure? Protect it and bring it along by storing the TP in an empty coffee can. I noticed uh, all the Mountain House has uh, awesome little sayings and stuff on the bottom, advice and whatnot. So uh, when I do one of these, I'm gonna try to remember and read them to you. All right, here's the directions on the back. Two cups of boiling water. You let it stand for eight to nine minutes. Here's the ingredients list if you'd want to pause and check that out, and the nutrition facts. I'm sorry about the glare. And it's made by uh, Oregon Freeze Dried Incorporation, Albany, Oregon. All right, further ado, let's get into this old boy. Oxen absorber out. Look at that, guys. Nice pieces of beef. There's a bean. Noodles with some meat sauce. Mmm, has a nice uh, chili smell right off the top. That's gonna be really good. Alright, I'm gonna get some hot water into this and then, uh, yeah. So. Two cups of boiling water. I will be using a IMP Sport from the Canadian Indian Ration. Right, give it a stir. Make sure you get all the corners. You don't want any dry stuff when you pour it out. Close her up and let her go for eight to nine minutes. Now let's get our tray out while we're waiting. All right, and with uh, the mountain house, I will be trying uh, baked snack crackers, hot and spicy cheddar flavor. So these are just like. Um, uh, Tabasco uh, Cheez-Its, and these should be pretty good. I've tried these before. I'm gonna use them and uh, put them inside the the Chili Mac, kind of gun dog it up a little. And then uh, cheese bread from an MRE, which should be pretty good. Make sure you knead it a bunch before opening. And then to drink, I will be having a beverage-based lemonade, and I will also be trying for the first time the Deep Rich Coffee. Which I've uh, I've had heard some mixed reviews about it. Some people say it's neither deep nor rich, but we will give it a test and see. All right, so I will pause and then uh, get my cup and stuff out, and we can start mixing and opening stuff. All right, I'm back and I have all my cups out and whatnot. Let's start making the drinks up. I will start with the the deep rich coffee, which comes uh, in a which comes from a MRE Nation MRE, which are awesome. If you haven't seen MRE Nation, please go and check them out. And for my coffee, I'll be using this awesome cup that Jordan from J&K Noob sent me. If you have not seen J&K Noob's channel, please go and do so. It is quite awesome. Yeah, let's get this open. Might not be able to see that. Mm, that's a nice roast coffee smell right off the top. It is very granular, or not granular, but powdered. Excuse me. And uh, at first I'm going to try it black, and then I will try it with the, the sugar and the cream just to see what it tastes like. So I'll add a little water. And we'll give that a, let that go. And we'll get our lemonade made up. 
And this takes about, uh, I think, 12 fluid ounces, I believe. Nice white powder. Give that a stir. Yeah, I get a really nice lemony smell right away. All right, and we'll get our baked crackers open. Let's see if I can get the information out for you. There's the nutrition facts. Here's the ingredients. I'm gonna pause and check that stuff out. And it's made by Ameriqual, or it's packed by Ameriqual. Yep, and they're just Cheez-Its. They have a nice uh, Tabasco scent to it, like a vinegary type scent. Chilies. Oxen absorber out of there. And we'll get our cheese spread opened up. And you really want to need this. I've done it to where you open it up and not. I forgot to need it, and it's all the oil runs. Use our handy dandy razor blade. Alright. All right, it's been about 10 minutes or so for the uh, the entree, but before we get to that, I'd like to try the coffee out and see how it uh, see how it tastes. So we're gonna give it a stir, and we'll give her a dry. Give it a this is black right now. Hmm, that's actually a really good quality um, coffee. I like this. I don't even like it black. It's really good. It's not really too acidic. It has a nice roast flavor. It's not over-roasted. It's not bitter. Really nice. Mmm. I actually don't even um, need the sugar or the creamer in it. So I'm not going to put any of that in there. We're just going to rock it black like that. That's really delicious. All right. Without further ado, let's get into the main. See how it, uh, see how it held up. Or, sorry. See how it... <clears throat> is sorry about the arm. So it looks like I may have put in a little too much water in. It is a little bit watery. So instead of putting the two in, I'd put in like one and a quarter or something like that. All right, dump this some of this out. Yeah, I'd do just a little bit less than than the two two cups because it's a little runnier than I'd like it to be. But that's all right; it'll still taste delicious. Yeah, yeah, it looks really good. Looks like it rehydrated quite nicely. The noodles look really re quite nicely rehydrated. The beans also. Yeah, look at that. It looks delicious. All right, let's give it a try. Hmm. Yeah, everything rehydrated nicely. I wouldn't say that it has a spicy sauce. I'd say it's actually lacking a little spice. It has, has a good flavor, but it's not, not very spicy at all. Hmm. All right, let's try these crackers out. This might add a little, uh, little heat to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was nice. It was a nice Tabasco -y flavor to it. Clean our palate with our lemonade, which I really like this. It's always good. Oh yeah, it's really, really good. Nice and tart. Mmm. Really good. Nice lemon flavor. All right, let's throw some of these crackers in here. Crush them up and see. And some of our cheese bread. Let's see what that does to it. Let's see if it elevates it, jazzes it up or any. Looks 
that in a little. Get on my spoon. Hey, look at that, guys. That looks really good. Hmm. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what it needs. The spicy little spice from the from these add a nice little crunch to it that is lacking. And then the cheese adds a nice creamy and salty bit that it doesn't have. Very, very good. Man, I highly suggest this, trying it this way with the cheese spread and the crackers. Yeah, very delicious. Mmm. Yeah, that's excellent. So far, all the um, the Mountain House freeze-dried rations I've tried, or uh, camping rations, are excellent. Absolutely delicious. Even the, the, the ones that come in the MCW is really good. Right, get more of our lemonade. Yeah. Those little sachets that they give you are way better than the other ones. Uh, electrolyte and the other one beverage base I don't know all I know is those sachets are delicious all right uh, all in all everything I've tried is excellent very delicious and I'm actually really surprised how the coffee tastes it's really good I was expecting it to not be very good and then I'm highly surprised this is delicious coffee Yeah, I like this a lot better than Type 1, Type 2, Type 3 that come in the uh, MREs. Really good coffee. All right, um, so that's everything for the review. Um, hope everyone liked the review. Um, thanks for watching, and uh, yeah, I uh, hope everybody has a nice day. Uh, thank you. I'll see you later.